Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you are new here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to turn your images into line art or sketches, essentially transparent PNGs of the line art or the drawn parts on there. This is something I use often when I'm using reference pictures, like reference sketches, or when I'm trying to import things from a doodle that I've done on paper or on a different canvas where I didn't save it transparently. So here's how to do that. Firstly, you're going to want to import your image, whatever one it may be. I got a reference from Google, so I'll be using that. When you get your image in, you can change the mag magnification to whatever you want. And I'm going to move this slightly to the side so I have more space for the other images that I'm going to import too. Then click Set. Right here will give you this option to extract line art. You can click Yes. And immediately you can move around and see how it looks and you can change this black point here to make the lines that are wholly black thicker. You can change the midtone, which changes the opacity of some parts. You can change the white point and when you are satisfied, click set. Then it will give you this, you can click no or yes. For yes, it will have this as a locked 8-bit layer. Now you will see that this is a transparent thing and those lines are the only part of that image that remain. So if we run a layer underneath the image that we imported here, you will see that it is just lines now. So from here you could work off of this, use it as reference or edit it. You could do whatever you wanted to the image, of course, as long as you're being respectful to the artist that made it. Of course, this also works with your own drawings. So if I imported another image, this is just a rushed two second doodle that I did and I can click set right here. For this one, I'm not going to extract line art and I'm going to show you how you can do it without extracting line art right there. So if you don't do it immediately, you can go into the settings of that layer and click line art extraction right here. Then it will bring you into the same vague menu. As you can see, this is now also line art and this is above the layer and then underneath it. This is helpful for old images that you have that you didn't save transparently, so you can just restore them. Or if someone else is doing a collab with you and they have a picture of the line art or sketch, you can just import it like that. Now for more sketchy imports. So now importing a reference that is a bit more of a sketch based one. Again, it's very important to change the black point to whatever you want here, especially for sketches. It's okay to make it a bit more visible right here. And now with the sketchier ones, you just want to go right underneath or on top of that layer. You can concept color if you go underneath it, so you could color parts in for what you want the vague result to be. Or you could go above it and start changing it so that it becomes essentially the sketch for your drawing. You can fill parts in and edit them and then use it as a reference if you want to. If you're going for a reference, I would also definitely recommend outlining the vague shape of the body, so just doing shapes that you can see are apparent there. Marking out joints, all that kind of stuff. It makes it really helpful to use as a reference because you kind of have an easier idea of how to replicate it. And that is how to change your images into line art or sketches in Medibang. It is super easy to do and really straightforward. Abyss has this feature too and overall I just really like how it's so easy to do especially for references and collabs specifically. Thank you very much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed, and if you did, maybe consider supporting. Bye!